in the deep blue ocean, a little clownfish named Finny was playing hide and seek with his friends. He swam through a maze of swaying sea anemones, giggling as he found the perfect hiding spot inside a hollow coral. Bubbles the pufferfish was feeling a bit down. She didn't know she could puff up so big. When she saw her reflection on the shiny surface of a diver's mask, she puffed up in surprise and floated up and up, feeling like a balloon. Squirt the speedy squid loved to race with the currents. One day, as he jetted through the water, he stumbled upon a group of dancing jellyfish. He twirled and swirled with them, laughing as they lit up the water with their glow. Luna the anglerfish had a bright lure on her head, which she used to light up the darkest parts of the ocean. One night, she discovered a shy sea turtle hiding behind a rock. With her gentle light, she showed the turtle that the dark can be friendly too. Whiskers the seal was curious about the sandy ocean floor. He dug with his flippers and found a colorful starfish who was looking for a friend. Together, they made patterns in the sand and laughed as they created their own sea art. Zippy the zebrafish had stripes as bold as lightning. He loved darting through the water, making friends with everyone he met. Today, he met a group of seahorses who taught him how to drift gently with the waves, a new way to dance in the water. Glimmer the jellyfish had a dream to reach the surface. One sunny morning, she pulsed her way up, up, up until she broke through the water and saw the sky. She felt the warmth of the sun and danced in the ripples of the sea. Flash the electric eel had a special talent for lighting up the water around him. During a nighttime gathering, he amazed his friends by creating a spectacular light show, flickering and flashing in the dark sea. Pearl the octopus had a garden of sea plants that she tended with love. Each plant was unique, and she knew them all by name. When a lost baby whale swam by, she invited him to hide among the leaves until his mother found him. Spike the sea urchin was the guardian of a hidden underwater cave. One day, a curious lobster wandered in, looking for adventure. Spike showed him the cave's treasures, and they spent the day exploring every nook and cranny. Flicker the firefly squid had lights on her body that twinkled like stars. She loved to swim up to the surface at night and match the twinkling of the stars above. The fish down below watched in wonder as above and below mirrored each other's sparkle. Tango the turtle was known for his love of dance. One day, he found a pair of seashells that clapped together like castanets. He tapped and twirled around the coral, making music that had the whole reef swaying. Dusty the dugong grazed on seagrass meadows, always on the lookout for the sweetest blades. One sunny afternoon, he stumbled upon a patch of the most delicious seagrass he'd ever tasted and decided to share it with his new fish friends. Twinkle the starfish loved to count the grains of sand on the ocean floor. She was so focused that she didn't notice a baby crab watching her with curiosity. When she finally saw him, she taught him how to count and they spent the whole day playing numbers games. Glide the manta ray had the biggest wings in the ocean. She loved to soar through the water, feeling the currents lift her up. One day, she took a group of small fish for a ride on her back, showing them the wonders of the ocean from above. Shelly the sea snail carried her home on her back, traveling slowly but seeing so much. She met a hermit crab without a shell and offered to share her home. Together, they journeyed through the ocean, sharing stories and sights. Finn the flying fish had a dream to leap out of the water and touch the sky. One day, with a strong flick of his tail, he launched into the air and flew above the waves. The sun kissed his scales, and he felt like he could reach the clouds. Whisper the whale shark was the gentle giant of the sea. She loved to glide through the ocean, watching the life around her. One day, she found a group of lost minnows and guided them back to their reef, becoming their big, kind protector. Bolt the Barracuda was the fastest swimmer around. He loved to race the shadows of the clouds above. One day, 
He challenged a group of squids to a friendly race, and they jetted through the water, leaving a trail of ink behind. Sandy the seahorse had a special talent for staying perfectly still. She could blend into the coral and surprise her friends. One afternoon, she played the best game of hide and seek, leaving everyone searching for hours. Gobi the goby fish had a cozy home under a sea fan. He loved to watch the bubbles rise from the ocean floor. One day, he invited a passing crab to share his view, and they spent the afternoon watching the bubble show together. Lacey the leafy sea dragon was often mistaken for seaweed. She enjoyed drifting along the ocean currents. One day, she encountered a group of tiny shrimp who were delighted by her leafy appearance and decided to tag along for a swim. Nemo the Nautilus had a shell that spiraled like a galaxy. He loved to explore the ocean depths. One evening, he found a glowing anglerfish and together they discovered a sunken ship teeming with hidden secrets. Wally the walrus was the king of belly slides. He found a smooth, sandy slope and slid down with a whoop. A group of penguins watched and clapped, then joined in on the fun, sliding on their bellies too. Dart the damselfish had a garden of algae that he was very proud of. He spent his days pruning and preening it. One day, a group of young fish came to learn about algae, and Dart became their enthusiastic teacher. Opal the orca loved to sing in the deep blue sea. Her voice would echo for miles, enchanting all who heard it. One night, she sang a lullaby that soothed all the young sea creatures to sleep under the moon's silver glow. Pebbles the parrotfish had a beak that could crunch coral. She loved to create sand with her nibbles. One sunny day, she showed a group of amazed snails how she could turn hard coral into fine, soft sand. Finnegan the flounder was a master of disguise. He could change his color to match the ocean floor. One day, he played a game of camouflage with a school of squid and they all changed colors together, creating a dazzling display. Bella the beluga was as white as the clouds and loved to sing. Her songs would resonate through the water, calling to her friends. One day, her melodies attracted a curious narwhal and they duetted until the stars shone bright. Spike the spiny lobster had the toughest armor in the sea. He loved to explore caves and crevices. One day he found a cave filled with colorful sponges and invited a shy Blenny to explore it with him. Casper the cuttlefish was a wizard of the sea. He could change shape and texture at will. One day he entertained a group of juvenile dolphins with his tricks, transforming into various sea objects before their very eyes. Zara the zebra shark had spots instead of stripes. She loved the confusion it caused. One day she met a school of juvenile sharks and taught them about the importance of individuality in the vast ocean. Nina the nudibranch was a burst of color on the ocean floor. She loved to slide over rocks and corals, leaving a trail of slime. One day she met a cleaner shrimp who was fascinated by her bright hues and joined her on her colorful journey. Sammy the seal was the best at blowing bubble rings. He could create a cascade of them with a single breath. One day, he showed a group of otters his skill, and they all clapped their paws in delight, trying to mimic his bubble art. 